First and foremost, what's your reaction to the vote today? Is it a surprise? No. Not Why not? Oh, because uh, uh, Rainey has always been biased. The Democrats have always been biased against me and Pisco going back 10 years back when I was chair of the Housing Authority. Um, if you don't agree with them, you're, you're out. They mm -hmm. can commit all kinds of wrongs, ethnic violations, ethnic codes. Nothing happens to them. Take the grant gate. Take the tax situation. Um, for Vivian to sit in judgment and vote against me, I'm quite surprised because her best friend's daughter, who OD'd twice here in Peekskill, I worked with Vivian to get her into a, a, a drug program. Um, it, like I said, it, it, it's a volunteer situation. I'm okay with it. I still will do what I do for my folks in the community. Um, and now you're saying as a result of that, you're going to run for council, is that correct? I'm going to run for office. I'm, I have not decided which. So it could be mayor as well. It could be mayor as well. Any idea what party that would be under? It would be, as I did before, Peace Go Populous, and I'm an independent, so I would run independently. You wouldn't join anyone's ticket. Like, for instance, the mayor last time, he kind of had a bipartisan ticket I'd on the honest, Catalina ticket. But I don't think that the Republicans are going to pick me. You heard what the NAACP said. That also goes for. Uh, the Republican Party here. In so you just oh, so you agree with well, a lot of the uh, was institutional racism? Is I think that's the the term. I don't agree with the institutional racism. Uh -huh. I think that what needs to happen. Can she come on? Yeah, sure, no problem. I think that what needs to happen is um, there are some things that need to be looked at. Um, I, I can't say the institutional racism because we have a black human resource director. Right. Um, well, what about the Republican Party in general? You don't think they'd put a black... I, I mean, no, I, the I history of the party, they, they had a... Person up, I think they are shy away from me because of what the populace here... Like, so it's you, not the color of your skin. It's just me. It's not the color of my gotcha. skin. I think they, they, they would be afraid of the controversy. Right. Um, I, I would run with them, but I would still remain independent. But they've not, they've never asked. I've stopped the yard for who I thought was best for the seat. Right. Which is generally a Republican. Um, so what's your next step now? My next step is to um, talk to my family and see just what I want to run for. I'll, I'll, like I said, I'll do it independently as I did the last. And what, when did you, what year did you run last? 2009. And you ran for what office? Mayor. Mayor. Okay. And I only got two percent of the vote, but then again, I came out last minute. I came out in the woods. Okay. So um, I will find out when the petitions are due, and I'll do my due diligence to get those petitions as I did the place on the ballot before. I'll do it again. Um, you also mentioned, uh, I think you said that con uh, Councilman Rainey, in your opinion, should have abstained from the vote. She should have. And wh himself. why is that? Because of his public um, social media bias against me, calling me doo doo brown, telling me he, he, over his dead body I'll be appointed. And this was early on in the game. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think that Kathy Talbot voted just because she's towing the line. I I think that the other side might say, well, if if Rainey should have not voted, recused himself, shouldn't the mayor have also? Because he's. At least people say you two are friendly. You're a supporter of his, so he might be. Brian, I'm friendly with everybody, and I support anybody that does the right thing. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter, Democrat, Republican, polka dot, elephant, snake. Um, but I, I, my experience with the Democratic Party, they've been down, low, dirty to me. They've lied on me. Take for instance, they were talking about the guy not getting paid. Right. Um, they tried to bring me up on charges for giving a benefit basketball game at the Kylie Center. So I did not sign that check, but then our board was out. They removed the whole entire board. That was under um, Mary Forster, like I said, um, and that's kind of what made me run. Will, will you be taking legal action or you're not sure? Yes. Okay. I will look into it. I will sue the city and name the three majority um, players. Gotcha.